just kidding. Hello, everybody. It's me again, and we're at Metro Kropotkinska, Red Line, center of Moscow. Why do we pick this place for today's trip, event, and a walkout? Because it's a cathedral over there. Uh, Tsvetkova guest house. Later, we'll take a walk, five kilometers walk, for our health, our stamina, on the Boulevard Street. You know Boulevard? The famous street for the Moscow people to walk here because it's calm. No strangers like me, nobody. So you can just walk with a kid or with a dog. Okay, this is the Christ is the Savior Cathedral, one of the famous buildings in Moscow, in Russia, in you know, all the religion in the world. And also there is a, a wooden church, so you know, you can see the difference, how it was and how it became. And this uh, big one, the beautiful one, it was built in the 90s, because it was re-established. It was built before, but then it was demolished. They made they made a pool of it on the Soviet period and then they rebuilt it. If you want to go inside it's, uh, it's not a problem but don't forget to use uh, you know a long 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 pants I mean if, especially in the summer period when everybody using shorts you won't be allowed to go into the in, in shorts in there and there is nothing you can rent or something like this so you can say oh I'm in a shorts but can I use the skirt like and I'll go in no this place is not allowed you to do this so take uh, jeans with your pants okay when you decided to go in yeah, yeah and it's working daily you can take a look in the internet of uh, graphic of opening so now it's time to go to the Gogolovsky Boulevard it's over there so our trip today is from the Christ the Savior Cathedral to the Cheburechnaya it's my favorite special place I'll tell you later so let's go on a Gogolevsky Boulevard, I'll show you a few things around. So we have a little bit of uh, church, a little bit of historical buildings over on the left, uh, it's a guest house, a little bit of culture and a little bit of walk on freeze. Yeah, baby, yeah. And this right here, one of my favorite houses, it's a, a Tsvetkova's guest house. It was built in the beginning of the 20th century. So more than 100 years ago and still looks good but because 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 it was built in modern style you know one of the first buildings in russia like modern 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 modern, modern style and everybody's like wow oh my god it was so beautiful and unexpected to russian citizens still it is and yeah yeah just take a step in and if you're a rich boy or a rich girl or a rich couple or just a rich person you can afford to stay there for a few nights so on Gogolovsky Boulevard, you can see a lot of interesting like places like this is the empty shop and everybody's guessing what was in there. It's so popular that when they bring it in there, everything's sold out in a second. So nobody knows what exactly are they selling. I think it's a magazine with, uh, I don't know, with some celebrities and scandals. It's very uh, attracts the tourists. A different buildings on the both sides is, you know, for the people who like to love to see interesting things. Just, you know, I don't know, maybe it's, maybe I'm stupid, maybe, I don't know, I'm not, I'm saying I'm, I'm not, but take a look at those three floor and uh, the second one is like a lot more ancient and the Stalin's, the Stalin's and Khrushchev period, this, the, the, the green, uh, the, the red one with the bricks, so ugly comparing to this one, can you see the difference? And that's why uh, the Moscow is so interesting, because it's a mix of everything. The pink one, the green one, and we have some gray one. And now everything is so colorful and beautiful. Yay! Oh, this is a place uh, very famous because of a sculpture from Mr. Mikhail Shalakhov, Russian famous writer. He was uh, make uh, bestsellers before, you know, John Rowling, Harry Potter, all this thing. He was the first guy. So uh, you might read uh, his very famous book, 
Silent Don, Tiki Don, but don't mess with the Silent Bob from the movies. So, and there's a sculpture for him, and uh, to be honest, I'm not sure uh, well, the story of the sculpture, but I have two theories and one you know, legend. The theory is, uh, theory number one, it's just, you know, they don't have time to prepare it, so they just make on the head uh, of the horses. <laughs> Second theory, when somebody like the garden said, we must build something for Mikhail Cholokov very fast. And they said, how much time do we got? Like two weeks. Oh my God, it's impossible. So, and they knew that there is supposed to be horses uh, and, and, and a lot of them, you know, it's too many horses, too many bodies and all those details. So they just put them in the water. So no bodies, no extra materials, no extra time, just the heads. The legend is that uh, there was like a, um, a guy, the unnamed sculptor, who received a task to make this. Uh, in a in short period of time and with a short, like uh, not a lot of resources, but he have a competitor very jealous, you know, like a Stradivari story. He was like, eh. <laughs> I ruined everything for you because I don't like you. And he took away like those uh, metal and stole it uh, from the, from this, uh, like, you know, uh, the art place. Art place. And the guy who's supposed to build this, like, oh my God, somebody stole my materials. What do I have to do? And he need to perform a sculpture for those powerful Soviet Russia. So he just, you know, hide the main, the bodies. So he don't have materials to make them. So he just drowned them and like, hey, that's a sculpture. And everybody, wow, it's so brilliant with such a common sense and a lot of ideas. And the guy who was jealous killed himself because he was like, I've done everything to ruin his life, but he's still a winner and I'll always be the second. Now we're in the middle of a trip and on the left you can see Arbat Street, very famous. It's uh, just for the walkers, no, uh, no drivers, no transport allowed, so it's very safe. Uh, many musicians, you know, art makers, uh, storytellers you can see on the street and it's very funny. So you should take a look and we will together but not today because you know we have to go on our schedule so uh, but if you're tired you can use a, use a metro right here and this is like this is the old arbot and this is a new arbot and the cars are loud already and there's like uh, shops and thousands of restaurants nothing interesting so keep on walking my friends keep on walking <laughs> this is uh the goggle house memorial museum and please do not mess with Gogol Bordello. It's not a band, it's a writer, a famous Russian writer. And you should like, you know, take a look in the Google. There is a translation so you can read some, some of his works and you will admire and you can step into his house. He was living here and working here, right here. So thank you, Gogol House, for Mr. Gogol. Just uh, you know, uh, and uh, and uh, and uh, I don't know what it is. It's like a bridge with something very beautiful. And uh, oh, hey, sorry for that, but you know, you can take it as a souvenir or as a earring. Oh uh, well, it's a place like looks like it's a place for girls. So yeah, but we need to go the other direction, and it's just you know for Instagram photos, like. Now it's here on the right to you and it's a building for the ETAR TAS. It's an information agency which is, was like mostly bring, bringing a, a lot of propaganda. Propaganda. A good one or bad one doesn't matter. I'm not talking about like propaganda about, you know, just the company. Even now you can see there there is news, uh, news lines on the world. And in the Soviet time, like 60 years ago, there was the first and the biggest company. And all the news on even on TV was started like each our task company announced that there is like something happened in the world and everybody was very expecting uh, what they are going to uh, say to us because everything new was brought by each our task. So that's the building who told the news to all the Russian people, but not told them they created them, bringing them. So uh, propaganda building. <laughs> this is what was Seven Union about. Strange forms, a lot of information, and a lot of trust and beliefs. 
So, so what, that was what all about. It's our task building. And the whole square is quite beautiful, you know, so you can cho choose your own direction. You can go there, like we are, red square, back to our bar, and yeah, yeah, and all the girls are taking the photos in that tunnel. But I love Moscow. I've been in a lot of cities, and Europe also, and the Moscow one of the best. And I always was like, you know, shaking when you see like a building like this from the Soviet Union, or like this from, uh, you know, also Soviet Union, like ancient, like almost Russia at the when there was the Tsar was in there, you know, in the in the end of 18th century, and then you can see all this, those ugly buildings. Those ones, I don't know the name, um, Khrushchevka, no, it's, um, I don't know, ugly one, beautiful one, ugly one, beautiful one, you know, the difference? Huh? Okay, uh, we're about to end our trip for the day, and our last stop is a Chuburech night, special place. We've talked a lot about, uh, hey, hello guys. We've talked a lot about uh, Soviet Union today, and this uh, uh, like canteen is represent Soviet Union as it is. So let's step in, have a great cup of tea. Eighty-five rubles. Like one dollar twenty cents. I like Chibuhex. Uh, I'm like a Chippendale coming for the rescue. You remember the Rocky guy, like with the mustache, who was spinning like cheese. And I was like Chibuhex with cheese. Yeah. We need two Chibuhex serum, one beer. Lager and one more domasny. For example, you can see they don't speak English, but they do understand everything. The most important don't forget to add some pepper, it makes the difference. Pepper is very good for your health, so there won't be like. Too much, too many, too much. <laughs> How to eat chibuhex serum? Well, there is two options. First, you can, you know, just hold it like this, like, ow, ow, and bite like this, you know? But we in Russia usually do it like this, just. Holy Jesus, you know. Get in one place. Mm. Have a nice meal. Chibuyak serum. I think of this wonderful workout as, you know, I've been like enjoying being your guide. So anything you wanted to ask me, just do it in your commentary. Subscribe our channel. Press the like the hard button, this is the like one, like, oh, oh, so everybody being, you know, happy. And yeah, see you next time, because I decided to go down sleep. And there is a metro, so 10 minutes and I'm at home. Cheers.